June 29, 2004. We're at the Occidental Chemical Facility in the High Levels Waterway, Tacoma. Doing underwater video transects looking for groundwater seeps. The EPA boat to monitor the whaler is here today with a couple of crew members from the Department of Ecology. This is Rob Peterson, my dive partner, and Sean Shoulder. We're on the bottom, just to the southeast of Pier 2. Here's some of this chalky precipitate. We're at 13 feet of water. This is what the what it looks like when it's been kicked up by the divers. It's a plume of white material with some particles, small particles in it. Close to the shore here, where the embankment drops off rather steeply. This is solid, kind of a whitish color to that. Chalky material, similar to the rocks that when I photographed down below. The depth right here, and we come up on kind of a platform. Here's some more uh, white chalky looking material. Six feet on the tape here. Some more. It's all hard material here. No discharge that I can see. Now we're sewing back to retrieve the tape. This whole face of this rock is, is that wake chalky appearance. This is more of a soft, well it's solid, but some parts are soft. Break away to the touch. We're heading off in a transect of 100 degrees. I found a, some of this material again, the precipitate. We're about 25 feet of water now, the 100 degree transect. The previous one was 150. And you see how we have now moved more directly into the channel. same kind of stuff we worked in in April, trying to get the mini piezometers to draw water through this, but it's just too fine, plug the Some more of this chalky material, this is a little bit softer, not quite as armored. 45 meters, 147 feet on the 100 degree transect.
We're descending the piling on uh, transect one. This is Bruce Duncan diving with uh, Rich Henry. We have tied off the uh, line around the piling. We're clipping into the transect line.